I, Mike Knox, at large position one city council member, on behalf of Mayor Sylvester Turner, do hereby proclaim October 18th, 2018, as White Cane Safety Day in the city of Houston. Congratulations. Ron White Cane Roy. Safety Day is a day that honors the achievements and independence of the blind and low vision community here in Houston. Ron this is the Roy. 11th year that the city of Houston has observed White Cane Safety Day, but nationally it's been observed like since 1964. The blind are able to go, to move, to be, and to compete with all others in society. The means by which this is done is that simple tool, the white cane. A lot of people's perception is just because we have a visual challenge is that we can't see. But the reality is I see more than you'll ever see with 2020 vision. God has given me the vision to see the inside of a person, to be able to see through the challenge. I take great pride in having a sight impairment. Uh, it's the way I was born and it's nice to see all these groups out here and, and advocating for people that are blind or visually impaired. Pedestrians with disabilities are five times more likely to be injured or killed in a crash with a motorist than, pe than pedestrians without disabilities. I think it's very important to recognize the uh, history of the white cane, what it means for us as citizens, pedestrians, and productive citizens. As someone who grew up with a disability, I didn't meet someone else who had my disability until I was 23, and it changed my life. Gloria and so to Mowgli. think that there are young people Gloria in junior Mowgli. high who are 12 who are just beginning to lose their sight maybe, or they, they were born Mowgli. blind, who can meet older adults who are blind and learn from them and have mentors, and that starts at this event, that is something that just puts me over the moon. It's awesome because you get to meet new people, you get to experience new events. Like these people, I just met them today, I didn't know them. So excited that I got to meet new friends and make new memories. It showed me a lot that I could get along with other people that have the same disability as me. That gives an opportunity for us to interact with others and, and uh, have fun. Who am I to be blind, pretending not to see them? The future of the blind and visually impaired is guaranteed here in the great state and in Houston. Thank you much for all you do. They follow each other on the wind, you know, because they got nowhere to go.